Former Made in Chelsea star Millie McIntosh has made surprising revelations about Meghan Markle, finally addressing her friendship with the royal on her Mumlamas and More podcast. The 33-year-old, who is a proud mother to daughters Sienna, 3, and 18-month-old Aurelia, got candid about her short-lived friendship with the Duchess of Sussex in the latest episode of her podcast, Ghosted. From mum friends to 90s musicians to duchesses, it's happened to all of us. Millie revealed the pair became friends after meeting at a hotel opening event in Istanbul around eight years ago, but was ghosted by the Suits actress shortly after she started dating Prince Harry in 2016. The podcast star admitted she was a fan of the actress at the time of meeting her and quickly struck up a friendship with the soon-to-be royal after chatting with her at the hotel bar. The pair bonded over their shared experience of divorce, Millie was going through a divorce with her ex-husband Professor Green, and Meghan had recently split from her first husband, film and TV producer Trevor Engelson. We would hang out, we'd go out to brunch, we'd go to yoga, we went for a stroll, I took her to my favourite spots in London, Millie told her CO star Charlie Bode. Millie went on to explain she shared her a little black book with Meghan, letting her in on all the best places in London and hanging out with the future royal whenever she was in the city. Then the last time I saw her was down at a hotel in the Cotswolds, she was staying there, what I thought was going to be a day of yoga ended up being rose and margaritas in the pool. It was a really fun afternoon. There were pictures taken of us riding around on the bikes. That was the last time I saw her, Millie shared, adding that Meghan made a passing comment that she was dating Harry during their final meeting. After stories about Meghan and Harry began to circulate in the UK press, Millie explained that she reached out to the star. I messaged her and said, Hey I hope you're okay, thinking of you, and she sent me this really abrupt message that was really unlike any of our communications before. The mum of two told listeners that Meghan's final message made her feel as if the Duchess wanted to end the friendship. I didn't message her again, but I did expect that we would stay in touch. I thought she'd message back and say, sorry everything is a bit stressful right now. However, she revealed, we haven't spoken since. The podcast host concluded that she felt Meghan had decided her soon-to-be royal status rendered Millie a reality TV star and unfit friend. She thought, right, I'm gonna be royal now, I don't need Millie in my life.